We're in Miami, Florida, where Victoria Azarenka has won the 2009 Sony Ericsson Open Women's Championship. And hello, everyone. Bill McAtee along with Mary Carrillo. And it was uh, not a 100% Serena Williams today, but Azarenka, very talented, 19 years old, and she really has today announced herself in the women's game. All credit to Victoria Azarenka for winning this one. It wasn't, it wasn't a good match. There, there's no two ways about it. But it was a very good win for the 19-year-old from, from Belarus because she's been climbing and climbing. She's been working so hard. She was in the top ten for the first time this week. Now she's eight in the world. And she's proven, importantly, that that she can beat a champion, even a hobble champion, right. it's, it's easy, it's, it's, isn't easy to take down. Serena will stay at number one in the world. And how about the injury? It was interesting afterward. First of all, during the match, Serena never asked for the trainer, no. never complained about it, didn't apparently consider even retiring. A lot of players would have done that. But looking ahead for her, does it seem like something that's going to take a while to recover from? Again, even in the press conference, she was asked, repeatedly what exactly is wrong and she said she's got an ankle problem apart from the quad injury she's got uh, she mentioned that she'll she may it may be a good idea for her to take off the next couple of weeks so that's going to hurt her clay court preparation certainly look we, we don't know how bad it is um, but she could now it seems likely that she'll lose that number one ranking to Dinara Safina right. uh, however briefly that might be all right, still ahead this weekend, it's the men's championship yeah. of the Sony Ericsson Open. Novak Djokovic and Andy Murray, and Murray has won the last two meetings between these two. Yeah, I, and Andy Murray is, is so very good. I, I, would give, I would make him the slight favorite in this, only because he's beaten Djokovic the last couple of times. Look, they're both tremendous defensive players, but they've also added a, an awful lot of offense to their games. Most recently, Murray. Uh, he's got a much bigger serve than he ever had, and he goes for winners more than, than he ever did. He, he's, he kind of likes to just wait around and counterpunch, and he moves right. so beautifully, and Djokovic can do that too. He showed that in beating Federer. I, f I think we've had a lot of nutty, wackadoodle matches here. <laughs> I mean, on the men's and women's sides, I'm, I'm really hoping that this becomes a nice, clean, good-looking final because these two are definitely playing better tennis than anybody. Uh, will it be nutty for the men's championship <laughs> Probably. tomorrow? Novak Djokovic and Andy Murray. That will do it for us here on CBS. Victoria Azarenka straight sets over Serena Williams, 6-3, 6-1.